Um, hello once again everyone, um, this is Lamin Sani of Elswat and today we're going to be doing a simple PHP validation tutorial. So basically we'll um, have one index.php file with just a simple form in it and then we'll just validate that when we post the values. So we're posting it to the same page and doing the validation on the same page. If it succeeds, we'll just show a message saying um, success which will redirect us to another page. Alright, so let's start by um, creating our index.php file so we'll say index.php okay and that gives us a simple html document with a php um, opening and closing um, at the top here so inside the body we'll just go ahead and create a simple form so we'll have four fields in there all with their own labels sorry so label and We'll have an input um, element after each label. Type equals to text. And the name for the first one is first name. And the ID, first name as well. So we'll just go ahead and copy that and then paste it four times. Okay, so we have four fields over here. So this second one, we'll name it last name. And name this last name as well. So now this type, the third one will be an email. Email. And this one, instead of being a text field, it's going to be password. And we'll name it password as well. Okay, so let's go ahead and add the labels now. Surely the text in the labels. So email. And finally, first name. Okay, so since each of the inputs have an ID associated with them, we'll go ahead and add this um, four attribute for labels and then we'll have to name it exactly as the IDs that they're targeting the ID inputs they're targeting so this one will be targeting last name okay this third one will target email and this fourth one will target password okay so we've got that so now let's um, add one more field which is the submit button it's gonna be an input of type submit and we'll give it a value which is the text that will be displayed of submit okay so now let's run our um, program and then we'll see what we have now okay all right so this is what we have um, it actually seems like it's actually fine but it seems like we do need some bit of formatting so we'll go ahead in our text editor and each of these fields will put them inside a p tag so we'll just cut this and put this in a p tag and do the same for this Um, email as well put it in a p tag and finally password as well put it in its own p tag save go and refresh voila that's fine all right so this is what we have so right now this isn't doing anything as you can see if we post we'll just go back uh, come to our same page so and as you can see at the top header here it is posting this as um, it is not actually posting it is posting the values to the next page using the get method so the reason for that is because in our browser here we didn't sorry in our form we didn't specify an attribute of 
um, type. Sorry, method actually. 